I was raised on a farm in rural Iowa where my parents raised uh, corn and soybeans and cattle and hogs. So it was a huge culture shock for me to go to a big city of Houston for graduate school. And while I've adapted to living in a city, I still maintain my country roots. Uh, my husband and I own farmland in Iowa that my brother uh, farms along with his farm and my parents. My father got his private pilot's license when I was 10 years old and it was the first flight I had ever had in an airplane and I loved it. I raised a lot of chickens and sold them for $2 a piece uh, before I had enough money to pay for my uh, private pilot's license with, with my chicken money. I shared my dream of wanting to become an astronaut with Dr. James Van Allen, uh, the discoverer of the Van Allen radiation belts. And he told me he really didn't think being an astronaut uh, was really all that important long term, that it wasn't really necessarily a good profession. A few years later, when I finished graduate school, I had a phenomenal offer uh, from an investigator at the Salk Institute, very prestigious uh, investigator in, at a very prestigious institute. Uh, but I called him up to tell him I was turning him down to take a, a postdoctoral fellowship at the Johnson Space Center. And he said I was making the biggest mistake of my life. I'm thinking it worked out pretty good for me anyway. I love landscaping and gardening so much so that some people consider it an obsession. I am by nature an introvert, but over the years I have actually found that it really is worth the effort to work outside of my comfort zone and uh, in order to be able to influence people and policies.